Hi guys, welcome, 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 welcome. So I'm back with another video and in this video, I post three tarot cards, three energy that's leading me into the weekend. And I like to do this just energy that's gonna take place um, for the weekend. And as well, I like to pull three tarot cards leading me into the week. So I normally do that on a Monday, and to start off the weekend, I like to pull three tarot cards on a Friday. So I thought, why not share this along as well with everything else that I do spiritually in my life, I like to share with others. So I thought, why not come on and share the energy that's gonna be leading us into the weekend. So I pull the moon card, Okay, which we'll go in more into details about the moon card, the energy that's going to be taking place for the weekend. I pull three of wands, all right, and I pull six of wands. So you guys could see this, all right. So let's start with the moon card. The moon, the moon is a major arcana card, all right. What energy the moon is going to present us going into the weekend so i don't like to read reversed all right i always like to read the card in an upright position all right so the moon card the energy that's going to lead us into the weekend is to pay attention to our intuition all right the moon tells us a something or someone, a person, or a situation in your life, right, may not seem or appear as it is, okay? So going into the weekend, trust your intuition, trust your instinct, okay? And what comes up about a situation or a person, all right? See past the in illusion right now and play close attention to your intuition, all right? About anything right now, it could be about a situation or person right now. Look past the illusion and pay more close attention to their feelings, your intuition about that person or situation in your life. So the moon card is calling attention to pay more attention to your intuition, to your gut feelings, okay? Going into the weekend. As well, the moon card represents that this weekend, pay more attention to your dreams, okay? And your subconscious. Something in your dreams, your subconscious is trying to bring forth. All right, a message that is trying to convey to you. So pay more attention this weekend to your dream. The moon card is trying to, the moon card energy is trying to let you know that there is a message that the universe wants to convey to you. Your subconscious mind wants to bring you a message. So this weekend, pay, pay a bit more attention towards your dreams and whatever comes up. All right, and as well, this weekend, you know, it's a weekend, unwind, relax. The moon card is trying to let you know as well is, you know, let go of any anxiety, any fear, anything that you have dealt with during this week, any negative outlook, any mood swings, anything that came up this week, you're going into the weekend of letting it go, all right? Not bringing it into the weekend, the energy, the negativity, you're letting it go. As of today, Friday, you're letting go any negativity, any mood swings, any anxiety that caused this week, all right? Let it go. You're starting off this weekend being on a happy note, all right? You're letting it go. Letting it go. As well, you know, is there any answers? Is there anything that you're looking for? Okay, it could be an answer that you want from the universe. It could be anything that you want right now to come up. The moon card is letting you know um, right now when it comes to any answers, is there anything that you want 
it could be delayed this weekend, all right? If you're looking for clarity or answer to a situation this weekend, it could be delayed, all right? But don't despair. The answers will come to you, but it may not come to you this weekend, all right? So don't be in a hurry. Just let things flow, all right? So the moon card is letting you know, just let things flow. As well, okay, and this is a weekend as well with the moon card to fine tune your spirituality, all right? Any healing work that you want to do is a good time this weekend to do it, all right? If you want to receive a message from spirit, this is a great time this weekend eh, to get in tune spiritually, right? If you light a candle, sit, meditate, all right? Any clarification, any message you want from spirit, now is a great time this weekend to go within, all right? Pay attention, like I said, to your dream. It's a great time this weekend as well to pay attention to your dreams, thoughts, vision, or gut feeling that you have about any situation in your life, anyone, or anything this weekend that comes up. Pay close attention to your dreams thoughts, vision, or gut feeling, all right? Your spirit guides are trying to convey important message to you this weekend. They're trying to tell you something important, so pay attention to it this weekend. This weekend will be a great time as well to go within and meditate, all right? Meditate, take that spiritual bath, all right? To be more in tune with the messages that the universe and your spirit guides want to tell you. So this is a great time this weekend to Sit, meditate, quiet your mind, and see what comes up. So play, please pay close attention to your dreams. Like I said, I keep repeating it, your intuition, and any gut feelings that you feel this weekend will be a great time for you to listen, all right? It's not a time for you to, um, you know, like my mom always say, run the streets, okay? You know, it's not a great time for you to run the street this weekend. It'd be a great time for you just to be quiet this weekend, all right? Go within. Take time for yourself. Pay attention to your intuition and your dreams. Whatever message is trying to come up this, this weekend is a great time to pay attention, all right? And let go of anything this week that came up that wasn't beneficial to your spirit let it go all right so the moon card comes up to let you know do not go into this weekend with any on animosity negative feeling towards anybody going to the weekend with quietness going within and letting go anything that no longer serves you all right this is a great time to let anything go that does not serve your spirit you spiritually, your mind, body, and spirit, all right? And intuition right now is important for you to pay attention to your intuition. It's right now is really important. There is a message that universe wants to convey to you. And meditating is a great way to get downloads from your spirit guides. And any message that wants to be conveyed to you, now is a great time to Go within for that message, all right? This is applies to somebody out there that there is a message that the spirit guides wants to convey to you. And now is a great time to go within and let that message be told to you, all right? Meditate, like I said. Meditate. Dream. Spirit guides love to show up in your dreams as well. Dream is another important um, way of getting messages across to you. All right, so this weekend is not a weekend, like like I said, to go run the streets. It's a weekend to go within, all right? Okay, so let's move on to the next card, the three of wands that we have here. What message want to come up for us this weekend? For the three of wands. All right, so three of wands could indicate this weekend that your hard work that you have done this week, all right? Any hard work that you have done this week, anything that you have done this week, all right? If you've put in the work, it's going to pay off, all right? You're going to this weekend to let you know any hard work that you have done is going to pay off. 
if you start off this week Monday with put it into work, all right, or your future goals or anything that you have done this week, growth is going to expand. It's going to expand, all right? It's going to take off, all right? This weekend is letting you know that it's time for you to just embrace, okay, in this expansion and growth that you have manifested during the week for yourself. So anything that you have done this week, all right, it's going to be successful. If you start a new YouTube channel this week, it's going to be successful. If you have spiritually grown, you're going to grow, okay? It was successful this week. So anything that you have put in work into this week, have self-confidence and know that you are on the right path. It's going to manifest. It's going to grow, all right? It's going to pay off, all right? You're going to be successful. So anything that you have started this week, okay, and going towards the weekend, anything that you want to work on is going to be successful, all right? Anything is going to be successful. Pay attention as well to your dreams, any messages, anything that the spirit guides, the universe want to convey to you. It could be a business, all right? Pay attention to your dreams towards any business, towards anything that wants to manifest for you. Sometimes we're unclear of what our life purpose is, what we're supposed to do, how we're supposed to expand, expand on this third dimension, but pay attention, right? Sometimes you get downloads of what you're meant to be doing, okay? And what business idea could come to you, all right? And moving forward and growth in your life. So this weekend is the time, like I said, to go within, focus on yourself, focus on how you want to grow, how you want to expand. And if you had started anything this week, it's a great time. It's time to let you know that it's going to be successful, all right? You're going to feel happy. You're going to be successful, all right? You're going to grow spiritual. You're going to grow in that business. It's going to be a fortunate, prosperous business, all right? It's, this card represents good luck, all right? Good omen for any growth in your life, okay? So... If you want to start that YouTube channel this weekend, this would be a great time to go ahead and do any business adventures, anything that promotes growth in your life. Start it this weekend. It's a great time. If you have already started this week, it let you know you're on the right path, okay? You're on the right path. It's a sign to let you know that things are moving forward in your favor and you're on the right path. Okay, it's time to spread your wings and your wings have been spread and it's a this is a sign to let you know that, yes, your wings have been spread and you're on the right path. You're going the right way, okay? Don't come off the path. You're on the right path. Listen to yourself. Listen to your intuition. Put yourself first. Don't go by what anybody else feels that's right for you, okay? Listen to yourself. Listen to your gut feelings, okay? You're on the right path. You're not, okay? If somebody else tells you something else, listen to what your gut feeling, your spirit guides, your dreams, your intuition is telling you you're on the right path. You're moving towards what you're meant to be doing. Okay? So growth is in your life. All right? You're on that path. This weekend as well is a great time if you want to... Um, travel if you're looking for a new home or if you're looking for anything that's going to be growth in your life is this weekend is a great time to start focusing on that okay if it is a new apartment that you're seeking this is a great time to start looking up those apartments you may not have the financial means right now but you know what you're putting it out into the universe you're let you're putting that energy out that you want growth so you start to put that energy out, it's going to pay off, okay? Don't worry about the money. Don't worry about how things are going to unfold. Just start. This is a great weekend to start anything that you want. Start, all right? Don't hesitate. Start. Follow yourself. Follow your intuition. Start, all right? Now is a sign to start. Anything that you want to start in your life, okay, start. If it's eating healthy, don't wait until New Year's to start eating healthy. Start doing it now, all right? Take that leap of faith. 
you're going to be successful. If it's losing weight, do it this weekend. Start this weekend. Don't wait until the 1st of January to start doing anything. Start this weekend. All right? And follow your intuition. You will know if it's the right thing for you or not. Okay? Last card is Six of Wands. I love this card. This card for me symbolizes success, prosperity. It's a celebration card. It means that you have overcome anything that's hard in your life. Is a well-wisher card. I love this card, okay? All right? You're going into the weekend feeling successful, all right? You're feeling good, all right? Whatever it is that you ever overcome this week, you're going to this weekend giving yourself praise, all right? This card symbolizes to me a celebration, all right? It's a really good feeling card. All right, you're going to this weekend feeling really good. You're feeling like you have control over your life. You're feeling like a leader. You're feeling confident, all right? It's a high self-esteem card. So like I said with the three of wands, whatever that you have been bogged down with this week, let it go. You're going into this weekend feeling so sure about yourself. You're feeling so successful. You're feeling great. You're feeling good. Anything that you want to start, start this weekend because you're going to be successful. The Six of One is a card that is, talks about success, victory, all right? You're going to be successful. You're going to gain victory. So be confident in anything that you want, all right? This is a good luck card. It's a great time to light a candle this weekend and do that ritual, do that spell, all right? Do that spell for money, for prosperity, for love, whatever it is that you want, right? The moon card talks about intuition and all that. So being as one spiritually, so it's a great time to go within. Whatever you want is going to manifest. So it's a great time to be positive and to let go of anything that no longer serves you. Going to this weekend feeling so good about yourself, feeling so confident. Know that you got it, all right? Start that YouTube channel today, tomorrow. You got it. It's going to be successful, all right? Start at weight loss today. Why not start today? Don't wait until January 1st. Start today. You're going to be successful, all right? The six of one is for me is a wish card. Whatever you wish for is going to manifest. Make that wish, all right? Make that wish. You're the leader of your life, all right? You're the leader. So pay attention to what you put forth spiritually in your mind your thoughts and all around you so this weekend sum it up it's going to be a good weekend all right but you need to pay more attention to your dreams your intuition and messages around you situation and people all right it's a good time this weekend as well to let go of anything that no longer serves you because you are moving ahead all right three of wands as you see this man right here he's not looking behind him he's looking ahead so anything that no longer serves you this week that you have overcome, you're letting that go and you're looking ahead because when you go ahead, you're going to be successful. So you're looking towards this weekend of being successful and letting go this week, all that burden, all that stress. If you had stress this week and things were just not working out for you, wasn't going the way you wanted to go, let it go. Walk into this weekend and being happy. All right, get a bottle of wine, chill, relax. All right, but don't go run streets. All right, because sometimes you pick up other people's negative energy. All right, it's time to go within, it's time to be by yourself and just focus on yourself this weekend. Focus on starting things for yourself because whatever you put forth, whatever you wish for, whatever you are gunning for, is going to manifest, it's going to be successful victory is for you all right the six of one is a wish card is a well wisher card is a victory that's a successful card so whatever you start this weekend is going to be successful all right don't wait start it start it start that business plan all right whatever goal that you have put in the back burner of your mind bring it forth start working on it even just jotting down little ideas this weekend Start doing it, all right? Because it's going to be successful. It's going to be successful. I'm saying it again. It's going to be successful. 
It's going to be victory. It's going to bring you. It's going to bring you that abundance, that wealth that you so want. It's going to be it's going to be great. If it's a YouTube channel, like I said, it's an Instagram, whatever you want. You want to promote your business, do it this weekend. Spend a couple hours just focusing on yourself and what you want to bring forth. Because anything you start this weekend is going to manifest and it's going to bring you victory. All right? Anyhow, I hope you guys enjoy this reading. I like to pull these starting off my weekend of what energy to expect and as well starting off my week. So I'll be back on Monday with three card. All right. What to expect for that week. What to look, look out for. All right. These energy could change. Okay. Nothing set in stone. So this energy could change, but it's how you use the energies to benefit you. All right. So anyways, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video along with anybody out there. And I'll see you guys again for another video. Bye.